Okay, this is how it's gonna go. Wandy, you'll operate the 50 cal. The rest of you, kill the creatures in your way. No! All the girls were involved in physical training and stunt training as well to learn the different fighting for the film. And that was months of training. We started so early with the physical training and the fight training because once you kind of go to war together and it breaks you down when you're working out, it brings you closer. So they look tough and they are tough. You knew it was going to take a group of women that could work together in a way and create an intimacy that was going to be believable, incredible on screen. That's the way Zach works. You know, his thing is use doubles as minimally as we have to. So that's why we get the heavy training up front. Your fight for survival starts right now. This was a huge adventure we were about to go on. Three months of training and we kind of knew that there was something big ahead of us. <laughs> we did take the baby steps to it, raising the bar every day, more weights, more reps, faster time, whatever, to get them inspired. We're pushing ourselves to places we've never gone to physically. You know, I'm a very active person, but I've never pushed myself to the point where I want to throw up, where I couldn't feel my arms. When you think you've reached your maximum, you can push through and you go to this whole other level. That's how I can deadlift, you know, 235 pounds. It's not muscle, it's will. With the girls, it was all supportive. It was like, this is a hard thing to do, but we get through it together. When they first started training, they thought everything was impossible. Now they know it is possible and they can have the confidence to do it. What they're learning is going to translate over to when they start swinging their swords or moving with their firearms, when Damon works with them. Don't ever write a check with your mouth. You can't cash with your ass. Learning to fight with Damon and the boys was like the most fun I've ever had on a film, I think. To use a sword, it's a pretty amazing feeling to be able to do that. I will use the double if we have to. It's not our goal. Our goal is to get you there. So if you want to be in that shot, work hard, work hard, work hard. And they do. Oh. Oh. One day we had the girls drop into the courtyard and they were nailing it every day after that. Are we can do the wires again today, we can do that drop in the day. Go, go, go! Next thing you know, we're taking them to the range to shoot live fire. It's a little scary before I did this film, like I never liked guns at all, and now it's just kind of second nature. Action! As soon as I go through a round of the 50 cal, my heart basically stops beating. Hey, Zach, you ugly mother! I just get the biggest rush. almost like a unit together, and they feed off each other, and it really shows up. The bond that we all formed, we instantly fell into our places, you know, who we are in the gym, who we are with these guns, who we were together as a, as a group, was who we were in the film. That nice. Even before the first rehearsal of dialogue, I was amazed by how they were those people. They had already bonded with each other in a way that was consistent with what the movie was going to be. The chemistry that they have with each other, all the girls, really is obvious on the screen. And that's something you can't make up. Yeah! Weapon tall, ladies! The girls kick ass, and they're emotional. I mean, that's the sucker punch. I don't think you're expecting that at all. We can do this. We are all finishing this. Nobody can mess with us. Honestly, the five of us together, no one can mess with us. <laughs> <laughs>